Well, howdy soldiers, Gold Meat 247 here, a first part of this Medieval 2 Total War Mongol campaign. We're gonna start it right away. I'm sorry for those of you guys that might not actually see my cursor, because if you're watching this on the live stream right now, you can't see the cursor. Alright, how do we play this Medieval 2 game again? I don't remember. Let's have a look at what we have for a start. So, we start in Bilgar, and this is a castle. Castle, we don't, you know, change the taxes in the castle. What are we going to do first? We will start... I thought about maybe converting it into a large town. I think that would be a good idea to start. But we'll build the farms. Start getting money. We'll have a look at our two armies. Because I have two of them. One here. Why is there no sound? They're not talking. This is just weird. But... That's alright, that's alright, we'll just play with that. I have a spy, it's gonna go right here. Move faster. Diplomat is going also this way. Move it. We'll get a... I have another spy. You're going south. No, that's a diplomat. And my spy also going south. Let's regroup the army all together. And see what we have in there. So I have two generals. Let's have a look at the first one. 18 years old. 7 stars. The other one. 27 years old. 6 stars. Um, this guy is gonna stay here. I'm gonna put it all together. Right? Huge army. I know it's, we it's weird to not see the cursor. But I guess it's because I'm live streaming and... This is not a new game, it's an old game. So that's probably why you can't see the cursor right now. Um, and there's no voices on those guys because we're playing the Mongols. And this is a modify file. If you want to play Mongols, um, if you look in the description of this video, for you guys watching on uh, Twitch right now, I'll put the link on Twitch um, if you want to download this file. Uh, one guy basically modified, you know, the one of the save game for Medieval 2, allowing us to play Mongols. So, where's this army going right now? I want to go... We'll go this way. We'll go right straight this way. We're building right now. Everybody has moved. You. What about you? Oh, he's good. Another 8. That's an 8 star. Uh, why don't you get inside this? Alright, so everybody's inside. It's all good to go. I don't have any troops. To... I don't want to recruit anything right now. I'd like to understand first what I'm going to need. And then we'll see after that, alright? Um, let's get for next turn right now. Hopefully, you guys watching right now on Twitch, nothing is going to crash or anything. Because this all... This can happen. Using old games. Move. I don't have to move those two guys. They're all set up to move. But I'll move it right now though. Diplomat after that. My army is moving this way. Everything is good. We're building farms again. We're gonna skip another turn. I get $2,000 from the console. So I guess Khan is sending me 2,000 florins. He's generous, really generous. I'm going to keep advancing here. I am honestly looking for Moscow right now. That's what I'm looking for. And I'm looking for the Russians. My army is big, so I think I'm going to... I might go wipe out the Russians right away. Or the Novgorods that are like right here. Alright. This is my first plan. This is what we're going to do in this part. I got my spy on the way. We'll go look south. I think I can probably pass through those mountains somewhere. And the Turks will be here. So we're just going to continue. Building stuff. Farms are always good. They will always give me more money. Um, so we will farm this castle. And go as far as we can into the farming thing. The music is cool though. Huh? So, let me advance my army again. 
I found Moscow. I just found Moscow. That's excellent. The Russians are already there to siege it. But they can't. They can't stop me. They're not going to stop me. It's not going to happen. You and you follow the army. I'm going to need... Why am I sending those two units? Because I'm going to need militia. I think there's a castle here we're going to take. We'll put the militia in and then we'll move to Moscow right away. And if we can, we will try to hit the Russians. I don't know where they are. I think they're here. Um, I find Moscow. I'm going to keep going. And then we'll get the spy. Can we get a spy through this? Yep. Excellent. Most excellent. Alright. So you guys are moving. You guys are moving. We're building. Next turn again. So this is a quick start. This is just a... Oh, uh, look at that. I got a, I got a wife. I got a wife. And... Um, I guess, I don't know about what's happening in the Middle East. I guess they just like their women, like, you know, Christmas presents. You don't see what it looks like until you remove all the clothes or something. <laughs> um, send an emissary. Where do you want me to send it? Oh, really? I'm just going to pass by first. You're going to go here. We'll get 500 florins if we make it there. I want to find this castle. There's a castle here. I knew that. I know that because I know the map a little bit. I tried to play it. By the way, you guys, uh, a lot of you guys wanted to see a Russian campaign. I had a lot of requests for that, a Russian campaign. Um, I tried to play a Russian campaign. The problem is the Russians don't have good troops at all. They're just not great in Medieval 2. And you get your ass kicked by, uh, what, Poland? That's like right here. Um, and really quick. And you need to actually beat them. They pretty much have the same kind of troops than Denmark. So they have heavy guys with hammers and huge armors. It's just really, really hard to do. Um, right now, are we going to build? I should have put a watchtower right here, but I can't anymore. But I should have put a watchtower right there. Um, this is a little bit of a mistake, but that's okay. Alright, we'll go talk with the Turks, try to get a trade, go for next turn. Oh, if you guys want to know, I have... I need to take... That's in the mission, that's what we need to do for this campaign. If you already look at that, you're going to tell me, well, dude, it's not a long campaign. No, not really. I have to eliminate Russia and Hungary, and I need 15 regions. Taking 15 regions will still be a lot of work, guys. So this is why I don't actually have a longer campaign than that. And I have no idea, you guys will ask about difficulty. Um, I have no idea what difficulty this is. That's weird. And you cannot verify it. I tried to verify that. I can't verify it. So we're going to go siege this castle. Let's see what's inside. I got 5-6 unit. And you guys will get the... You, you guys will get to see the rocket launchers in action today. I actually never use rocket launchers. Um, why am I going to Moscow first? Because I need a city. I need money. So we're going to take cities first. We'll find where the Russians are. And we're going to hit the Russians really hard and take them, you know, take them out of the game. Maybe not in this part. But definitely maybe second part will take the Russians out the way. So we'll get all of their territories. That's right. Um, anything else we're building right now? Hey, keep farming. Keep farming. Make me more money. We're still over the 10,000 we started with. Um, <laughs> it's all good. You can just skip the turn right there. Yerevan. This is where you're going. Let's have a look at the south. By the way, the file I'm going to give you, I'll give you a link to a file. The file I'm going to give you, you will be able to also play uh, Timurids. So if you want to play with, you know, those guys, it's also something you can do with the file I'm going to give you. It's basically two save games. One for the Mongols and one for the Timurids. Um, I'm going to go for next turn. So we can siege the castle. And have a fight. Helloa. I can assault right now. 
Really? Should I assault right now? That is one of the questions. Should I assault right now? Can I open the walls with those rocket launchers? I don't think so. We'll get a bunch of ladders. Here we go. We'll maintain siege for a turn here. So it's a bit easier to do the siege. Construction's doing well. You're going to Yerevan. Yep. That's fine. Let's find the Russians. They're here. They have two territories right now. This one and this one. So we'll take Moscow first. And yeah, there's a big army. I know. Uh, not that big. We'll take Moscow first. And then we're going to be, after that, moving into right into his capital. And hopefully, he'll, he's not going to have time to take other territories, so this is good for us, right? Um, and that's the reason why. You guys want to see rockets fire at infantry. This is the reason why I'm going to siege. We'll open the walls, and then we'll get the rocket launchers inside. Um, let's go for next turn right now. You guys didn't move. Here we go. So the campaign is doing really well so far. Nothing in my way. The rebels should not be a big problem. I'll advance this army first. We'll make sure that we ha we keep an eye on the Russians. And that they're not expanding anywhere else. I could have skipped that. I could have skipped this castle, really. And then go right for Moscow and Novgorod. I thought about it. But I think it's a gonna be a lot more fun if we do this all right first assault guys he's got 350 men archers militia and Kazakhs all right fight on the battle map uh, it's not actually this is the vanilla version of the game believe it or not if you guys you guys asking what mod I'm using um, hold on I'll give you, um, for those of you guys watching this on YouTube right now, you should maybe come over on Twitch TV if you want to watch me do that live. Here we go. I'm just going to give you guys a link here. Here we go. For those of you guys on Twitch TV. Oh, he's talking. Lua, start deployment. Warriors. Okay, so where is my where are my tools? What's happening here? I can't get through the wall with rams. I don't really want those guys to hold the rams because I prefer those guys. All right, I guess we're gonna start the battle like this, and then I'll move stuff around. I want to see that shoot. He's gonna go in the middle. We should be able to hit them with... Uh... No, we can't hit the walls with that, right? We'll bring the other ram. He's got people on the wall. Archer militia. You can run with ladders in medieval too, by the way. What, do you have? what does he have here? Spear militia. Archer militia. Go for it. Um those guys will drop ladder. I don't need the I don't need this. Move it. This is like my elite infantry by the way. Um we'll get them right here. We're doing good. Rocket launcher! And then the rest is all cavalry. Th this is light cav. I'll get it here. It's gonna start shooting up the wall. We are winning this battle. Soon our cowardly foe will flee like a whipped dog. So hopefully he's not gonna burn my first ram. Although he's shooting arrows at it, but it, it's up. fine, it's fine. Climbing them will only make our warriors more thirsty for blood. You probably noticed that I am not using huge units right now this is this was set up on small with smaller units so I'm just gonna play with this I got lancers here 
We need to act. Yeah, I know we're under attack. Hold on, hold on. We're climbing up the wall here. Battering ram is in place. It will not be Boosh. long our enemy's defenses fall. We'll hit the archers. He's moving troops on the other side. We'll move this unit too. We are crushing our enemy. Those fools cannot We're getting in. Us. I'm fine here. We need so what do I, uh, what else do I have that I can move around? Those are lancers. We'll wait for the door to open. Then we have more archers. The battering ram has done its work. Now it is time for brave hearts and brave deeds. Alright, I see that. I see that. Let me see. What can we hit with rockets here? Rocket! I'm gonna see that shoot. Alright, zoom in. One shot from the back and then we'll go one shot from the front. Show. Wow, oh, this is long to set up. Hopefully I hit something. Okay, no. I don't think I'll hit anything. This is nuts. Oh, I hit this general. Or whatever cavalry is at the back. Oh, man. That actually worked. We have bled the enemy badly. They have only half their men left. Get inside. Get inside. Drop the ram. The crazy rockets. I hope I'm not killing my own guys. Okay, okay, stop. <laughs> oh man. This is just crazy. Our brave warriors have taken the walls. The rest of the settlement is sure to follow. We're having a little trouble on the wall, let's help them. Come on, I want to set up here. Yeah, I'll set up those guys behind. Those guys here. I'll get ready with my cavalry. I'll, I might advance another rocket launcher inside. Hold on. Uh, uh, uh. But this is crazy, guys. It shoots non-stop. I've never seen that. That is some crazy machine. Crazy machine. And yes, I have to concentrate, guys. I'm trying to I'm trying to not lose that many troops. Bra. Get in. Let's get in. What's up, Mr. Schmechlock? Thank you very much for watching. The enemy warlord flees. Our most worthy warriors have captured the enemy general. Give oh yeah. And make sure he doesn't want for wine while we slaughter his army. Wow, we're strong. We're wiping his ass. That's just militia. And my bows are still shooting in the bunch. Hopefully I don't lose too many guys and I can retrain. Alright, I'll stop the bows. Stop. And then my rocket launcher is coming. We're not gonna have to use it. It's gonna be fine. As soon as he split one unit, it gets killed. It's getting killed, so... 
Nice one. Nice one. I'm pretty happy. By the stars, curse the fates. Our men no longer command the castle. We don't command the castle, really. I think I'm commanding it right now. Attack. Look at my troops. Zoom in a bit. That's our first castle. Oh, he's on his knees. Kill him. Oh, excellent. Great victories like this go to only the greatest of men. That's right. And I'm the greatest. So we lost on this battle archers and some spearmen, but those are militia. We can retrain them right away. And this is what we're going to do. I did shot at my own guys. But this is not going to re really, really slow me down. And yes, I'll be, if you guys are asking, I'll be doing more close-up. We will occupy the settlement right now. This is a castle. Everybody is already happy. Um, wow. I will need to upgrade this castle right now. To be able to just get... Levy Spearman, I need to... I will... Re I'll repair the castle first. We'll get the farms done. But don't forget guys, I have two units coming behind. So that's uh, that's the reason why shooting on my guys, I don't really, really care. And I didn't know how strong those bows will be. They are almighty. I mean, they're crazy. Um, Let's keep building on. We're doing good here. What can we recruit? Nothing right now. I'll finish the farm and then we'll get the mustering all, I guess. Peasants. Yeah, we'll start by the mustering hall and then we'll see after that. I'll put on the queue. So I don't have to come back to that. And then for this place, I choose the farm first. We might do uh, same thing, mustering hall. Maybe some roads if we need to. But we're going to Moscow. That's what's important. I just want to leave this castle and move to Moscow right now. Um, still keeping an eye on those guys. They're not moving. They don't have another army. We keep an eye on the army. You're going to go see the Turks. See the Turkish king. And talk to the Turkish king about a trade agreement. So we can start making cash. Uh, we'll go next turn. Okay, he's splitting his force. There's another small army. Um, another small army. This one here. I'm just gonna move it out. I'll take this and we'll go to town. We're going to town. That's right. Going to town with this army. The full thing. Because I can actually put this in the castle. Well, you know what? Hold on. I'll take the full army. That's control A, by the way, if you need to know. Uh, I'm going to regroup some units together. All right. And then we'll leave one unit behind. We'll get out the castle. We'll get one unit with the army. The other unit in the castle. It's fine, because it's, it's really easy to keep one castle happy it's really not a problem and then now we'll go attack the russians right now we're taking moscow because it's a large city and this is gonna give me essentially yes this is gonna give me more money so we'll go siege it i don't know if he's gonna move his army to try to defend it we'll keep an eye on this i'm gonna put my spy right here and the siege is coming up only next turn no that's two turn we gotta move through the forest um repair complete that's excellent. We'll finish the farm. Strongest faction. See, I just started. I just started, and I have the strongest faction. I don't know what the others are doing, but right there, we are doing pretty good. So by taking Moscow, we'll be taking the north. Uh, and then if we can take Novgorod after that, that would be great. If there's nobody in it, we can just take Novgorod. If he's not on time to, you know, come over and attack. I'm, I just hope that this army will move away. He's going to probably try to attack somewhere else. And then we can sneak in. Whirp, and take Novgorod right under his nose. 
I think that would be the best plan. Um, are we going to start building watchtowers right now? Uh, yes. Yes, I'm going to start building watchtowers. I'm not going to do one right now because I'm right next to the castle, but I'll be doing watchtowers. Hello, hello. How about a little trade rate? Huh? How about that? It is not Accepted. Thank you very much. I'll get more cash in the next couple of turns. Um, my spy is going south because that's what I want to show you guys. Timurid. So if you guys uh, if you guys are actually click the link I gave you earlier, um, if you actually click the link I like I said I gave you earlier on Twitch and if you look down if you're watching on YouTube right now have a look at the description of the video just click uh, see more and then you'll have a link to actually get those files. So if you want to play the the Timurids also it's a great file for that. You'll just start right here and then you can expand. I don't know what they have. Do they have elephants? Yo, yo we'll go have an eye. Yo, yo, <laughs> we'll go have an eye onto that, all right? And I'm gonna continue to try to get trade rights with them. Might as well. And we're exploring the map at the same time. Because I never remove Fog of War, guys. Never. For me, that's cheating. That's just cheating. Um, we'll go to the next turn. Okay, he's sending a small force. I don't know where. But he's probably going to take another territory. Mission failed. Oh no. What, I didn't talk to them? Oh, I forgot. I can do for you? Okay, we'll get trade right. Your time was most I saw somebody else here. Who okay, there's... You? What, there's no army in town? What is he doing? This guy's crazy. This guy is just crazy. Let's start building watchtowers. Whoa, I got a view on the forest. So we'll start building watchtower. I'm gonna get to my construction. So you guys don't have to watch actually uh, my construction report and report starting in the next turn. So mustering all because I need to be able to recruit people. And we are done with another. Mm hmm. We are done with another place. I will be building another farm. Unless this is... No, there's not a lot of people here. There's no point turning that into a city. It's not going to grow or anything. I'll be doing another farm. So a lot of farming on this part, guys. You move here. You move here so we can see his I army. They have elephants. See? So if you guys want to play... If you, wanna, if you guys want to play that, you'll get elephants... And they look pretty crazy. Those guys have guns. What? Wow. Okay. I should have picked those guys. But uh, yeah, you look, you have good troops, right? You, you have good troops for a start. And you're starting in a really good spot. Aleppo. If you uh, if you get the, the thing that I posted in the description. Um, you'll be able to take a lot of cities almost right away. And this is going to be... This is one of the good ways. If you want to... If you, let's say, don't want to use stainless steel, because let's say you're not familiar with stainless steel. Because, yes, you can play Mongols with stainless steel, if you want. With, uh, I think, an early era campaign, you can play stainless, you can play the Mongols. Um, and this is how we're going to end, guys, the first part of this Medieval 2 Total War Mongol campaign. Don't forget, if you're watching on Twitch right now, I'm just going to take a quick break and you guys can watch the second part right away. If you're watching on YouTube, make sure that you click the like button. All right. W whichever, you know, finger you want to use. As long as you click on your mouse and you give me the like. And don't forget your comments also. The next part will be uploaded really, really soon. Thank you all again for watching. And have a good one.